Okay, here we are now with Paul Rodriguez Jr. and it's our first time to meet you, Paul. And congratulations on thus far a fantastic career. You. you have carried a lot of the hopes and uh, the joy and the satisfaction of your folks, of our culture, wherever you go. And uh, congratulations on some outstanding efforts. Oh, thank you so much. Happy to be here. Let's talk about the motivation. Why not a basketball? Why not a soccer? Why not a baseball? You, you, you love the skateboard and it's become a part of your body. Yeah. Um, well, I mean, I played all those things, basketball. I joined the league in school when I was young, baseball, all that stuff I played, but it was my choice, really, I look at it as it was God's choice because basketball, baseball, everything, I kind of just lost interest, kind of mm -hmm. just phased out of it, and, you know, did my thing, and, and then I kind of just wasn't into it, and mm -hmm. once I once I met the skateboard, uh, <laughs> it just, to this day, I haven't lost that interest, I'll just stay hooked, stay, for whatever reason, I don't know why, but something about skateboarding kept me interested and never let me, you know, kind of lose interest yeah. in it, you know. As I say, it's about a man and his favorite toy, instrument, uh, yeah. whatever you call it. But that has become uh, a very, very strong motivator to many of the youngsters that we see here. You've inspired because of your abilities and your God-given talent to do this. Well, you know, like, like you said, God-given. Uh, I didn't do none of that. God gave me all of it. And uh, I'm glad I'm able to use it in a positive way and uh, inspire youngsters. Because I was just, you know, seemed to me just like yesterday, I was one of these guys. Yeah wishing to meet my favorite skater and to actually have become that guy is kind of surreal so mm -hmm. uh it's it's a cool thing i'm blessed to be living the dream and uh i'm thankful the greatest achievement thus far of course the x games and of course being a nike uh, spokesperson and of course your own shoe yeah, yeah. nike you've attained you've attained so many heights already what's in store for paul rodriguez jr again that's up to the lord me i just focus on skateboarding trying to be the best skater i can be best athlete i could be and wherever that takes me from there, I'm open to the opportunities. You know, I just wait and see what, what the doors God has opened because a lot of these doors I've already went through, I wasn't even necessarily looking to go through. They just kind of uh, happen, you know, and I just kind of live my life that way and come to believe that, uh, you know, just by having that faith, it's just going to keep happening. Well, you know, East L.A. has made a very, very gallant effort to make the skating parks available uh -huh. to our kids and to give them another opportunity to yeah. excel at a sport. Yeah, and it's such like a, it, it's compared to most other sports, it's relatively cheap, you know, it may be a couple hundred bucks to get you all started, but, you know, it's no different than joining a little league and having to get a baseball bat and a glove and all that to get started. It's just something you can do right here. You just need a skateboard and some concrete and roll around, you know what I mean? It's a real fun thing. It's really satisfying because you don't have a coach telling you what to do or you got to be at practice on this time. Yeah. If you feel like skating, you go out and you mm -hmm. skate and you learn what you want to learn and watch your videos and it's all what you get out of it, what you put into it. You know what I mean? So it's really satisfying, self-relying type thing. And you, made it, you said a good word, satisfaction here because we are in Latino Heritage Month yeah. and you are very, very connected, of course, to your roots. Your dad has, has brought you through through many, many uh, situations, I'm sure, uh, to show the pride in our community and our culture. Yeah. Uh, your thoughts on this year being a very big part of it? Oh, man, I'm happy to be, you know, considered a, a Latino that kids can look up to doing something positive in our community. It's a great thing, man. And, you know, growing up, I never really looked at it that way until it started being pointed out. Yeah. And it kind of, uh, then I kind of realized, yeah, it's a cool thing to, you know, to ha you know, for kids to look up to you, especially if you're of a certain heritage, mm -hmm. uh, especially in a, in a heritage where, you know, we need more people yeah, that you can look up to and more people for us to get motivated, get the snowball yeah, effect rolling, course, you know course. what I mean? A couple of generations from now, we'll... We'll, we'll all be in the top seat, you know? You are very prideful. Your family is very proud of you. We are all proud of you in East L.A. and beyond the world, the nation, Mexico, you name it, wherever our cultures reside, they've seen your fantastic uh, uh, abilities. Uh, let's talk a little bit very quickly, Paul, before we let you go. Your calendar, your menu, what's on, uh, right up around the next corner for you? Uh, next corner for me, I'm going to go to Orlando here on, like, the 17th and skate the uh, final stop of the AST Do Tour. Hopefully, maybe I'll be able to pull out a win, maybe, hopefully, you know, and take the whole tour. After that, uh, it's kind of, as far as contests are concerned, it's kind of off-season until probably about March, April. But in between, uh, skateboarding is never an off-season. I'm always skating every day. As long as I feel healthy and not too sore or anything, I'm skating every day. So um, immediately, I'm just going to go try and take care of that dude tour. And other than that, just focus on this Plan B video we're working on and right. continue bettering myself in skating. Last question. Yeah. Your favorite move. Your favorite move? Favorite move, it's, it's impossible to say. I, I always say just any trick that I can land and roll away from is my favorite move, you know? <laughs> I'm happy. 
Paul Rodriguez Jr. Thank, thank you so much. Thank gracias. you. Yeah, thank you. Okay, there it is, right there. Our pride and joy in our community, Paul Rodriguez Jr., as he continues down the road of life. And there are his fans. As he is a superstar, a megastar in the world of skateboarding and the X Games and all those other new sports that uh, Nike is going to be a part of.